Thank you to join me on stage from Wyndham Rotary Club. Thank you so much for your time and effort. From Wyndham Rotary Club. Before I pass on the mic to Phil Harcher, I must share, we both are colleagues at Bindam Rotary. And it is my great privilege that he is the community director there, previously I was. Normally people learn from their predecessors, I am learning from him. Such a great work he is doing and being associated with JIT in helping distribute the free food and all. He has done great work. So before I pass on the mic, I will pass on my hat to him. Does it look good? You look Maharaja. <laughs> I am so, so privileged to be here today to share with you the celebration especially about equality because we are all equal. Even more so as I look around the room and I see a diversity of people here it's uh, absolutely fantastic. And I also uh, agree with the three C's, which probably means very little or something. Connectivity, we connect with each other. We help each other compassion, we all share a compassion for each other and I forget what the other one was, <laughs> community, yeah, that, that would probably be it as well. Um, now I've had a long association with Jet Australia Foundation, uh, the Victorian branch and you know, I remember many, many stories about uh, how we cooperated. That was the other word, cooperation. How we cooperated with each other, especially uh, during COVID. We were lucky enough that uh, uh, a couple of people in our uh, Rotary Club had passes so that we could actually go out into the community and give out uh, food, etc., to uh, the underprivileged. And if you remember back to those times, well, which was only just a few weeks ago, really, uh, there were so many people that were in dire straits. And through the good work of Satya and his team from Jet Australia Foundation, we were able to provide, a, we never kept count, but it was over 1,500 uh, boxes of food to various agencies uh, in the Wyndham community. Not only that, I don't know whether you would remember or not when Shepparton was split in two and one half of Shepparton couldn't get food. We called up Satya and the next day we had $20,000 worth of food on its way to Shepparton. That just shows you the good that Jet Australia does within the community. 
Also, the other, stro other story, I don't know if you remember, but we got 500 uh, Afghan refugees that came into Wyndham. We had uh, one day's notice that they were coming and we worked with uh, Wyndham Park Community Centre. We got 150 packs of groceries from uh, Jet Australia that afternoon and ready to give out the following morning. Also, we got uh, toiletries from other agencies and things from everywhere and clothes. And we also had a request for burkas and prayer mats. You know, you can't get them, any. We, my, my lovely wife ended up talking to a podiatrist who was a Muslim and said, Sarah, we need your help. We need your help. We need some burgers and prima. She said, where am I going to get them from? Well, we don't wear that stuff. <laughs> but the next morning, there were six bags at the front door. So that just shows you the connectivity of all of the agencies. And that is why it is an absolute pleasure, an absolute, absolute pleasure to work in harmony with Jet Australia Foundation. Thank you. My good friend, unfortunately, has been diagnosed with pancreatic cancer in fourth, fourth stage. So we'll request Swamiji and all present to bless and pray him quick recovery. Thank you so much, Phil, for those amazing words. Um, obviously, united we stand, powerful, and that's what makes our Indian community stronger together. So a big round of applause for Phil one more time.